what sales process we use to qualify the leads. You probably click on this video because you are running Facebook and Instagram ads and you can't get enough qualified leads. You probably get one, two leads, probably submit your form, but you can't convert them to loyal customers. So in this video, I'm going to cover since funnel, CRM and sales qualification method to qualify leads, of course, for your business. So pay attention, grab a pen and paper because on this video, we're going to bring value to you and your business to how to scale it to qualified leads and get your loyal customers for the rest of your life. Just pay attention to this video because we will try to bring value as you bring your time to watch it. Thank you. First of all, before we get in, how we can qualify leads, how leads get to us, what systems MFA agency use to get leads for customers and get leads for partners that are with us, how we can help them to generate leads. So the first step that you use one, of course, is simple, is an ad creative. That ad creative is really simple. We normally do videos and normally image. Uh, we are working with only proven businesses and you probably are a, a business owners in that space. And we are helping them with these kind of videos like before and after explaining what kind of offer using local target areas. And we use this kind of advertisement to generate leads, but they are not qualified. That is the problem. When you only use ads, they are not qualified. You need to have a system behind it to get qualified leads. So let's cover this into next slides. And I'm going to promise you that if you pay attention, you will get value from it. So the second step after the ad creative is having a funnel or a form. As you can see here in the main image here, you can get your free consultation by simply submitting a form. We have several questions about the service, timeline, budget, and little things that they can describe into details through the form. And of course, I need to submit their contact information so we can get in touch with them. But by having this funnel, and I'm going to explain you further how we can qualify them through these questions, as simple as that, we get their customer information. And that's important to get in touch with these people. They are, if, if they are interested in your advertisement, they probably have something that you can help them. So qualification call is the third step that we have. As you can see here, we normally always put after the landing page, a simple page as thank you for submitting we'll get in touch within 24 hours. Normally, our team on MFA agency get in touch with those leads after five minutes. We drop them a text message, an automated text message, and then if they respond, we try to engage them in a short period of time. If you are doing and you are trying to implement this in your business, don't call after 24 hours because they most probably forget about you. So I'm gonna show you also a system. In the previous video, I'm gonna promise you that you need to see it. To implement the mastering of Facebook and Instagram ads with follow-up system KPIs, if you're gonna watch this video, I'm gonna put it down below and the end of this video, go check it out. So the qualification call, I'm gonna explain you how we do it and how we qualify those leads by that. The funnel that brings 10 plus customers every month for the business that are with us. How we build it. That funnel, really simple, two to three questions, um, budget, timeline, details about the project, just keep it simple. It's easy to the customer understand what they need to submit. Customer information, full name, email, phone number. If you want, before you do the customer information like this, and if you are doing, if you are doing ads directly to a Facebook form, you can put as simple as these three questions, but if you are putting that to a landing page, you can put what is your street address and your postal code to see, also to see and analyze if your ads are targeting the right area, if you are targeting your local area, matching address to the target area, basically. So these three examples here, as you can see, you can use them as a landing page here on the right or a Facebook lead form as in the left. This final brings us 10 plus customers every month to the business that are working with us. Before you go on, what is a qualification call? A qualification call is not a sales call. Although we do and we practice sales calls in our agency, we try to understand sales. But what is sales or qualification call? Basically, a sales or a qualification call is an understanding of the customer needs. That's all. You don't need to be pushing questions about it, trying to uh, give away your service, trying to be the lawyer of your service having a clear understanding of the customer wants, basically what the customer wants. This step saves you time and money. So any qualification call in your sales process is really important. Make sure that you are calling leads when they submit their contact information within 24 hours. Make sure that you have the right questions to make and you try to build a report with that customer to see if it's valuable to a free consultation, whatever you give a free quotation, so you can understand more about them. But you are probably asking why we call in our behalf how we can do it. So here on MFA agency, we use a CRM, Customer Relationship Manager for our partner. This is a software that you can manage all the customer that comes from social media, your emails, your SMS. We have 
access to everyone that can touch with you with just one software. And as it is, go high level, have a sales force behind it. So we can build everything that we need to have a sales force behind the CRM. Since text follow-ups, having buying numbers and managing phone numbers to call those leads in your behalf. So we set everything on the behalf of our partners. So everything is clear for the client and there is nothing to confuse. So if the client submit the lead form, we know if we are calling them, we are calling them in the behalf of the businesses that are working with us. So that's how we keep it so simple. But you are probably asking why we don't miss book appointments and how we can manage book appointments in a time that you, you can go there and deliver your consultation. So let's go further and I'm going to explain you how. So book appointments. The CRM gives us the chance to connect a mutual calendar. Google, Calendly, etc. can be an Apple calendar. A mutual calendar is really important. An online calendar, as you have in your cell phone or your PC or tablet, whatever you use, is too simple having a time that is available. We normally book the appointment in a time that the business owners that are working with us have the time to go there and deliver the consultation. We normally put an half an hour or an hour, it depends on the range and kilometers our, tower or our target area is working to book the appointments. So that's how we don't miss any appointment for the person who delivers the consultation. And if you have a project manager that do also the consultation, we also work with them. We can include them in the software, really practical and really simple to use. Go High Level is one of the best software that we use as a CRM and also a Salesforce for our own agency and for our partners. Making sure that those book appointments convert is also important. So any follow-up systems, book appointments, new leads, no shows, every situation was designed to convert. As you can see at the bottom, before we go there in the optimizations, we have leads, hot leads, schedule appointments, got estimate, follow up and job one. All the things that you are watching here, you have this implemented with automation. So since getting new leads, since hot leads, after we have that talk with them, after we schedule the appointment, after we got estimate and the follow up, after we deliver them the quotation and after having the job one, if you convert, congratulations, you have your job one and you don't need any kind of automation to put it there but you need to have follow-up system. As I said before, go watch the, v the previous video that I post here about mastering Facebook ads because I'm talking a little bit more about follow-up systems and how you can generate more book appointments with it. In the right here, you have new lead, no schedule follow-ups, appointment confirmation, follow-up, hot leads, nurture, campaign, job one, update lead status, remove workflows from basically having a job one. You don't need to have any desk optimizations basically. You just need to remove automatically from the workflows. Lead Facebook APIs, payment optimizations. Basically, we also have payment collectors if you have an upfront fee from that customer. Schedule Facebook KPI. So we have every optimization designed to convert more book appointment as you think you have. Because when you are building a Facebook advertisement, the first thing that you will notice is you don't convert leads as the first step. You probably get 5% of the leads that click in your advertisement converted, but 95% of them, they are not converted. So you need to have this kind of qualified questions with sales calls, with optimizations, book appointments, new leads, no shows, every situation designed to convert. Because you're probably thinking, but how? How the customer that clicks will not convert? Just it's simple because in, they are in the cell phone during the day. They don't have time to get in touch with you, probably get in touch with them. They miss your call then they will forget about you again. So you need to keep that follow-up, that messages, basically to have that customer comfort. And that's how you can build customer acquisition channel. A customer acquisition channel, when you have a predictable customer acquisition channel, is simple as that. Every follow-up systems and sales conversions that are designed and you can project the future of your company. So having a CRM and a system that will help you to qualify more leads will also help you to build your business. But how we know that works and why I'm talking about it. So every process used and tested by several business owners and you are not the first one watching this video. You can be the next one. How? The next steps. First link below for a free discovery call with me. Yes, with my agency exclusively for the next three business owners because we don't have a lot of spots and we only work with 10 business owners periodically. So we have three more spot opens to work with three more business. Second, and you need to promise that you will do this. You will review this video and the previous one and you will take notes about heads and about the sales process that you use. So when you come back to the call, you already know what kind of questions you may have. You are not the first one coming to this call, so don't worry. It's completely free, no obligation. As you can see, we had several business owners with us that come only for the free discovery call and probably they will get the decision to work with us or not 
or to just take questions and we also help them to understand what kind of social media platform works best for them, what kind of social media strategy will work for them. So make sure that you click the first link below, leave your contact details, get in touch with me, book a time free in the calendar below and I hope to see you in that call. If you like this video, subscribe, turn on the notifications. If you guys don't follow me on LinkedIn, I promise you that I'm posting there a lot of content during this week. So I will let the link in the description. You click in the description, you have my Calendly, also calendar and MFA agency free consultation call with me. And you also have my LinkedIn profile. So you can check that out, what kind of content we post there, how you can understand more about customer care, business wealth. It's also a thing that I share with business owners that are connected to me. Weekly videos coming out there in this channel to help business owners understand the potential of social media and their business. By the way, we have a business growth series here going out in this channel every Friday. So make sure that you subscribe and turn on the notifications to check those videos out. Thank you for having the time to watch this video. I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you.